organize its leadership in the Senate Assembly, kicking out errant members who have in the recent weeks dined with the head of state, President William Ruto. The Azimir Premier Raul Odinga says the affected members have been dropped from influential House leadership positions as punishment for going against the coalition's principles. And as our reporter Henry Tandon files, Odinga reiterates there must be a far-reaching reforms at IEBC to enhance electoral justice for sustained democracy. Emergency meeting of its elected members in Mansoni Machakos County in the wake of defection by a section of its members to the Kenya Kwanza. Today, the opposition coalition Azmio has held a roundtable meeting in Nairobi and resolved to reorganize its representatives in the Senate Assembly, kicking out errand members. The minority leader is Honorable Stuart Mazayo, deputed by Honorable uh, Senator Enoch Wambua from Kitui. Uh, the whip is Honorable Ledama Olekina, deputized by Honorable Edwin Sifuna. And that is our lineup in the Senate. This is because um, uh, some of officials who were there before have opted to now work with uh, the majority party in the Senate. In the changes, Jubilee Lawmaker, who is also the senator for Isiolo Fat Madulo, has been dropped from the influential position of chief whip and replaced by Narok Senator Ledama Olekina. So we've asked our team to continue to uh, represent Azimio effectively in the House. Azimio stands for the defense of the people of Kenya, the interests of our people uh, in the House. And uh, we want to, them to continue to articulate issues which are affecting our people uh, right now. With Azimio insisting it won the August 9th general election, Raila is now demanding that IEBC undergoes key reforms to enhance electoral justice for sustained long-term democracy. Kenyans must defend electoral justice. People fought for a long time to bring multi-party back to this country. And they are not going to surrender that again and take this country back to the dark days of single-party dictatorship. Odinga taking a swipe at President William Ruto for leading the nation in praying for rainfall and economy. Raila insisting the problems bedeviling the nation can only be solved through sound leadership and not persistent prayers. The challenges that this country is facing today the issue of electoral justice that we have been talking about. And this is not an issue that is going to die until it is properly resolved. We have shown beyond any doubt that the elections were rigged. And it doesn't matter how many times Mr. Ruto shouts, how many times he prays, the prayer is not going to help him to get away with theft. Of elections. The Azimio Supremo maintains he will not tire in his quest to bring democracy in the country. Henry Tende, Look Up TV. Thank you.